Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com and today we have another jailbreak tweak for you. This one is going to make it possible to wave your hand over the front of your iPhone to either put it to sleep or wake it up. Okay, we're going to open the City Store. Tap on the search in the bottom right, type in sleek, sleep, one word, tap that, tap purchase, tap, uh, then sign in with whatever account you want to use. Enter in your password, select the way you'd like to pay, then tap close, and the purchase will turn into an install. Tap that, tap confirm, wait for it to install. Once it's done, tap reboot device, and wait for that to happen. Okay, once it restarts, go into settings, uh, go to sleek sleep. Uh, you can enable it, disable it, turn on insomnia, which means that uh, the sensor is always working even when the screen is off uh, or the device is off. Uh, could drain your battery a little bit, but makes this kind of work a little bit better. Uh, disable it when calling, so obviously when you're on the phone, it won't turn on and off the screen all the time. Uh, you can make it set to portrait only, so it's only when it's in portrait mode, just standing up like this, not landscape mode. Uh, you can also set it to an activator event. If you don't know what activator is, click on the link here in this video or beneath this video on our site uh, to go to our video to show you what that is and how to install that. Um, that basically allows you to set it to another event instead of just the proximity sensor. Um, then I highly recommend going down here underneath that. And before you get started, uh, this will allow you to change the swipe duration, the swipe timeout, the swipe length, etc. Um, and this kind of gets you to make it work properly for you. When it first is set to default, it doesn't work that well, honestly. Um, so what I did was I turned the cooldown all the way to zero and I turned swipes to one. Um, and I didn't touch these, but again, you can adjust those to make it better for you. But with that enabled, um, you can kind of just wipe your hand over there and swipe again to get the screen to come back on. And there you go. I hope that helped some of you. And if you'd like to check out some of our other tips and tricks or other how-to videos, feel free to follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Google+, or subscribe to our YouTube channel.